The iOS 18 beta has been open for a while now, and today I'm heading towards giving you four tips and features where there might be something you don't know about. 1. Widgets. Widgets are easier to use this time around, you don't need to delete and edit them and re-add them to change the overall size. Long press on the widget and you'll have different size options. If you want to make it bigger, it will automatically resize everything. Long press to resize it again to make it smaller, or even to the app itself. This feature works for any app that has widgets. 2. Calendar App View Apple has updated the calendar app views with an easier way to access them. You can tap Compact, Stack, Details, or List at the top, or you can pinch the calendar itself or pinch back to change the overall view size. Easily switch between different views. 3. Messages Send Later You can now schedule messages to be sent later in iMessage. Open iMessage, tap the plus sign in the lower left corner, select More, and tap Send Later. Enter the message you want to schedule, select a time, and tap Send. The message will be sent at the time you set. You can also click here to change the time, choose to send immediately, or cancel the timer. For dot Wi-Fi sharing, you can easily share Wi-Fi passwords via QR code and Passwords app. If you have someone visiting your home and they want to connect to your LAN network, then you can go to the Password app, unlock it, and see the LAN and passwords. If you have saved Wi-Fi passwords, you can easily share those passwords. Clicking here also shows a QR code for the network and allows them to connect. It gets easier, doesn't it? That's all for today's for iOS 18 tips. If you found it useful, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.